The owners are left trying to rebound. Some of their merchandise can't be sold. WHS 1119's Connor Steffen found out it's not the first time this business has dealt with this kind of adversity. At Free Hype Shop, a sneaker store on Bardstown Road. It's a big thing here. Experience is everything. Like I love when people see me out in public and they're like, oh, you know, I went to your store earlier. I Owner Garrett Sissel has made sure of it, building the company from the ground up these last six years. This is all I have. This is what I do. But recently, shelves have been empty. Unfortunately, we're missing about 100 plus sneakers overall. And property in disarray. And basically, um, they tried to break our glass window. And the total cost. I'm guessing 30000 plus dollars. How? Watch this. So we actually had our shoe store get broken into. Right, so I guess when I first watched it, though, the first thing I think is just like, wow, you know, like it does make you wonder, like, why do I do this? From the store security cameras, you can see at least four suspects ransack free hype shop Wednesday morning. Sissel says the burglars took a lot of mismatched shoe pairs. Lots of broken glass right here. Making much of the merchandise unsellable. And then uh, we've had a series of other unfortunate events. Just two weeks prior, a break in at Sissel's other location, 10 minutes down the road. And that's just kind of one of those things that does mess with your head a little bit. You know, you don't, you don't know how to look at people the same when you don't know if they'll rob you. While the negatives have boggled business for now. But at the moment, man, we just want to get back open and get back focused on, you know, our community. Here. Sissel and his shop's employees are looking toward the future. Really just focusing on getting my shoe store back open, keeping everything in motion. Bringing perspective to a terrible experience and keeping his business on high alert going forward. In the Belknap neighborhood, Connor Steffen, the WHAS 1119, on your side. And let's hope he rebounds. We certainly need to support our local businesses. And Sissel says Free Hype Shop is accepting donations as it tries to bounce back from this latest burglary. Again, hit three times so far. You can find a link on their GoFundMe page on WHAS 11.com.